in the kitchen with Graham Elliott and his son Conrad, and his mommy is joining him too, Allison. And we're going to be making an apple tart and learning about. That, That's there you, you are. That's you. It? Look at there you are. Don't you look <laughs> handsome? That's me. Yes. Are you going to help us cook today, Conrad? Yes. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> okay. Nah. All right. Now, is, cook. Graham, is this something you make what often you with you, Conrad? This is, you know, we have three boys, Milo, Conrad, and uh, Jedediah. And Conrad, by far, is the foodie of the family. Oh, okay. He loves going to the restaurant. He loves going through the walk-ins and the market and playing with all the ingredients. This is something that, you know, Allie and Conrad actually went to uh, some cooking classes. They worked on this and put mm -hmm. this together, and he loves to... Oh, to look at those. Look, look at him cooking. Oh, yeah. 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 Really, oh, my God. Yeah, he throws down. <laughs> In your Chicago, you did in the Chicago yeah, you did Chicago. Right. Oh, well, excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you take your little brush and you can start to show us how we can make the tart, Connor? Let's do our first you. step. Yeah, yeah. there's your butter. Our butter. Hey, let's go ahead and use your paint. So while you're painting, do you want to tell us about your yeah, you incredible yours. journey that you've here. gone through, Conrad, with your weight loss? Because we understand you lost 150 yeah. pounds. How did you do that? I did. Well, you know, I got to uh, 400 pounds with. I don't even knowing it, it just kind of creeps up on you after years, yeah. and uh, decided I needed to, to do something drastic. So I had a sleeve gastrectomy. What is that? Is that That's different than a, a, one of those bands? It things? is. They basically remove almost 90% of your stomach, so it forces you to, uh, to eat in smaller amounts and to eat smart. So now I'm uh, working out three, four times a week. I'm running, you know, five miles, practicing for a marathon this fall. Did it change the way you looked at food and approached Absolutely. your... Absolutely. How so? Be, because instead of using it as a crutch and something to make you feel good, you know, uh -huh. just you eat it? Uh, yeah. for a second, I started thinking of it more as fuel and, okay, I want protein. I want something that I can, you know, use sure. to feel better about myself physically as well instead of, uh, you know, eating something heavy, a big bowl yeah. of pasta that right. you get nothing out of. So, yeah, it's really changed how I think about things. It's like the idea, yeah. eat to live instead of... Yeah, eat. exactly. So, and, yeah. Uh, you know, again, being able to taste proteins and vegetables and gorgeous fish with a simple vinaigrette. Like, you know, you look at food different yeah. because I think after a while you almost accept the uh, the fat guy role, whether it's on TV or just as a chef. Like, well, you know, you never trust a skinny chef and this is what you're supposed to look like and I'm the fun guy. And then you just realize, like, no, I have a wife, three kids. I need to do whatever I need to do to be alive. I've tried. I trust Fabio. Yeah. Although not to have him drive me to work, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, Are you able to eat this, though? Because I know it's, it's very thin and brown, you don't use a lot of food. butter. Would you choose something else inside of butter or would yeah. you allow yourself to have a piece of it? No, I mean, this is like whole wheat flour and, you know, cinnamon and, and cane sugar. It's not corn syrup. And I'm not as crazy about, you know, I can only eat these few ingredients. I can go to a restaurant, do a tasting menu. I can do everything on MasterChef and still taste. The uh, the biggest thing is just quantity. Can you we? Know? Can you want to see what we have here with Conrad? Look how beautiful yeah. this is. Colin, good job. Put some sprinkles of the cinnamon yeah. on it now. Sprinkle uh, did the cinnamon. You? Yeah. Oh, Put it on all around like it's raining. Make it rain. Make it like rain. This. Look. Beautiful. So when you finish okay. doing that, you have to fold it and then yes. bake it in the oven. Exactly. So very well, wait, simple. Wait, is this just a tortilla? What do you put in it? Yeah, it's, it's a little... just a, a, a simple tart, you know, dough with flour, okay. whole wheat flour, some well, butter. I, I was like, what? yeah, I, know, I caught myself. Did you say tortilla, Yeah, it's a tortilla. Then. It's, a tortilla. it's a more expensive than, than a, a tortilla, tortilla so I went with that. I, I caught myself. I oh, caught the expensive is like the best ever. How are you doing that? I'm just. I'm just simply going around and folding it. You know, my thing is, you know, keeping it nice and, and rustic. You can go back and pinch it and do all these things. But I think that's an, another thing with my cooking. It used to be really, you know, molecular and, and super artsy. And now I just want to make food really delicious and simple uh, and let it taste like itself. Look at father and son. Conrad, here's <laughs> yeah. better than I mine. give it's Conrad a little round of applause. Yeah. I thought he did a good job. And then we'll put these in the yes. oven. Yep, and we already have some in here that oh. are ready to go. Oh, it's magic. So. Ah. Voila. Oh, good. Look, Nan. And Conrad, look what I have for you, sweetie. I have Ooh. ice cream to go with it. Wow. I like that. You want to put one on? You want I can eat the one more. You want to eat sure. one more apple? You eat another one. Is a one. Oh, it is? Okay. Get a better one. There you go. Is that a good one? Would you like some ice cream, Conrad? This way, this on the top. And the cinnamon? Oh, and then the cinnamon. Oh, yeah. 
around. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> There's sugar in the wow. cinnamon. This Our, is great. Uh, uh, when are we going to see? You guys are filming now, right? Yeah, uh, exactly. So, so we're doing MasterChef, and then we roll into season two of Junior MasterChef, which is eight to 13 year olds. Uh -huh. That, again, is an amazing opportunity for us not only to inspire kids to cook, but to cook healthy. You know, letting them know that obesity is a huge yeah, epidemic is. in our country. It starts, you know, with them understanding great it's ingredients, how to cook things properly, uh, and really letting them know what's out there. You know? when, when do we see these episodes? Uh, MasterChef will start in May, and Junior will start in the fall. Nice. Oh, yeah. really great. Great. Isn't that great? Thank you. It's very good, very good. Um, for full recipe, Pinterest is, is the place it? to go. Uh, we'll give you this, that on the bottom of our screen right there. And we also have a very <laughs> special message from Graham on how you can get involved with Smile Train. You can go to our Twitter page for that.